Hello, welcome to the PARS Health TV channel. We hope you're having a good day and you are happy and healthy. In this channel, we give you tips to keep you healthy and out of trouble. In this video, we want to talk about the 6 best quadriceps knee pain relief and strengthening exercises. This video is for educational purposes only and if you have any specific condition or illness, you should consult with your doctor. Whether you're a competitive athlete, a weekend warrior, or a daily walker, dealing with knee pain can put a kink in your favorite activities. The good news is there are several ways to treat knee pain, including stretching and strengthening exercises that you can do on your own. Doing these stretches regularly can help a person develop an increased range of motion, and reduce the risk of pain and injury. Lower body strengthening exercises may offload unwanted stressors on the knee joint, by improving shock absorption through enhanced muscle strength. Some causes of knee pain include Injury, including sports Overuse or repetitive movement Inflammation of tendons Osteoarthritis Rheumatoid arthritis Obesity A person can take several steps to help prevent injury and relieve knee pain. Tips for maintaining knee health Steps people can take to protect and maintain knee health include Moving about and taking regular exercise Doing low-impact exercise, such as swimming or walking, if recovering from knee pain Using a knee wrap or bandage for extra support Wearing shoes that offer proper support during physical activity Doing warm-up and cool-down stretches before and after exercise Increasing exercise intensity gradually Losing weight to ease pressure on the knees may reduce inflammation and increase knee function in adults with obesity who have knee osteoarthritis. If you like topics like this, make sure to subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon to see daily videos just like this one. Alright, let's get started. Before you start stretching, it's important to spend at least 5 to 10 minutes warming up. Low impact activities like cycling on a stationary bike, walking, or using an elliptical machine are good warm up options. Here are 6 stretches and exercises to try, including step-by-step -step instructions for each. 1. Quadricep Stretch Stand upright with feet flat on the floor. Bend the left knee and hold the ankle to pull the leg behind. Gently pull the ankle toward the buttocks. Only stretch as far as feels comfortable. Hold on to a wall or chair for balance, if needed. Hold this position for 30 to 60 seconds. Return to the starting position and repeat with the right leg. Try to avoid twisting or arching the back during this exercise. Repeat the whole exercise 2 to 3 times, 6 to 7 days a week. 2. Calf Stretch Stand upright with feet flat on the floor, and weight balanced over both feet. Hold on to the back of a chair or a wall for support, if needed. Stand on the leg with the painful knee, and lift the other leg. Lift the heel of the standing foot off the floor, then lower the heel back down. Repeat 10 times, centering body weight onto the ball of the foot of the standing leg. Lower both feet back to the floor and then repeat for 2 sets of 10 repetitions, 6 to 7 days a week. 3. Hip Abduction Lie on one side on the floor, keeping the leg with the painful knee on top. Bend the bottom leg behind for support. Bend the lower arm to support the head and place the hand of the upper arm on the floor in front for balance. Straighten the top leg and lift it upward to a 45 degrees angle. Keep the knee straight without locking, and avoid rotating the leg. Hold in this position for 5 seconds, then slowly lower. Rest for 2 seconds, then repeat. Repeat 3 sets of 20 repetitions, 4 to 5 days a week. 4. Squat. Stand with feet flat on the floor, shoulder width apart. Rest the hands on the thighs, reach in front, or hold onto the back of a chair for balance. Keeping the chest lifted, bend the knees, and lower the hips about 10 inches, 25 centimeters. Keep the weight centered on the heels, and avoid bending from the waist. Hold for 5 seconds, then push down in the heels to slowly return to starting position. Repeat 3 sets of 10 to 20 repetitions, 4 to 5 days a week. 5. Wall Slide Stand upright against a wall, with the back and buttocks pressing flat against the wall. Position the feet about 12 inches, 30 centimeters, 
apart from each other and about 6 inches, 15 centimeters, away from the wall. Gently bend the knees and lower the hips to slide down the wall. Bend the knees to about 45 degrees and hold for 5 seconds. Gently slide back up the wall to the upright starting position. Repeat for 10 to 15 repetitions for 3 sets, 4 to 5 days a week. Be careful not to go too fast or low when doing this exercise, because this could worsen the pain. Stop at once if there is any pain, cracking, or crunching of the kneecap. 6. Lateral hip and thigh stretch. Stand upright with feet flat on the floor. Cross the left leg in front of the right foot. Keeping both feet flat on the floor, lean to the left by bending at the waist and pushing out the right hip. People should be able to feel a gentle stretch in the outer right hip. Hold for 15 to 20 seconds and repeat the whole exercise 3 to 5 times. Repeat with the opposite leg. Exercise should never cause pain or make it worse. Remember, muscle soreness after a hard workout is normal. But sharp, shooting or sudden pain in the muscles or joints means you should stop and check with your doctor. Gentleness is good. So skip high impact activities such as running or intense aerobics. Notice what feels right for you. For example, some people love elliptical machines, but others don't. Swimming, jogging in water, or water aerobics are often great. Double check with your doctor about your exercise plan. When to seek help. Knee exercises should not cause additional or worse pain. People should stop any knee exercises and see their doctor if they experience severe pain, swelling, no improvement after a few weeks, inability to move knee or put weight on it, knee locks or clicks painfully or gives way. A doctor may need to carry out a physical exam or tests, such as x-rays or MRI scans, to determine the cause and diagnose the condition. People may need to see a physical therapist for a specialized stretching program. Knee pain is a common ailment that affects over 18 million adults each year. Performing stretching and strengthening exercises that target the muscles that support your knees may help ease pain, improve range of motion and flexibility, and reduce the risk of future injuries. With any type of joint pain, it's best to talk to your doctor or physical therapist before starting an exercise program. They can help you select the exercises that are safest for you. They can also recommend modifications based on your knee pain and the underlying cause. If you are interested in videos like this, make sure to like this video and subscribe to our channel. We hope you have a wonderful day. See you in the next video.